Officer here at 5 o'clock, a couple driving home becomes the target of a road rage shooting. Police say the suspect shot the passenger and then kept driving right on the Lake Hefner Parkway. News Night's crime tracker Jennifer Pierce spoke to one of the victims who saw it all unfold right next to her. Jen? Amanda, that driver had to rush her husband to Integris Hospital here on North Portland last night. The suspect's bullet went through their windshield and into the man's shoulder. The frightening ordeal started near Wilshire and the Northwest Expressway Sunday night. Marquisha McClendon thinks the construction in the area ramped up the other driver's anger. McClendon says the suspect in a dark colored SUV was aggressively tailgating her. The person that was driving was on my butt for a, a while. It was to the point where I thought the person was just going to hit the back of my car. McClendon told police she purposely slowed down, but that only angered the suspect even more. The woman allegedly got out of her SUV at a stoplight and yelled at McClendon. Words ended up being exchanged between the two vehicles before finally shots were fired from the suspect vehicle into the victim's vehicle. McClendon says they were getting on the Lake Hefner Parkway when the passenger leaned out of the window with the gun. But it all happened so quick. I personally did not see. I just heard the popping noises and then my windshield was broke. And the bullet hit her husband in the right shoulder. The suspect continued driving, but McClendon drove to the nearest hospital. Police say the man's injury was not life threatening. I'm just thankful that, you know, we are able to walk away from the situation. My car, I can fix. I'm not worried about that, but I can't replace my husband. And the only description police have right now of the suspect's vehicle is that it was a dark colored SUV with dark tinted windows and it had a paper tag. Police also ask if you were in that area of the Lake Hefner Parkway and Northwest Expressway last night and witnessed the shooting, call Crime Stoppers. Reporting live in Northwest Oklahoma City, Jennifer Pierce, Oklahoma's own News 9.